cafe. <laughs> so first thing, we get into the plaza and they push the llamas on it. <laughs> I just really wanted to hold the llama, but it ended up being like 200 soles for us to take a picture and also in the picture here, but that was fun. This is really good. It's a little spicy. It's chimichurri with um, like a chili in it. Ooh. It's like a salsa. No, I wouldn't say a salsa. I probably would if I'm better. Is it like a salsa? But like their own version of it. We're at Inca Grill, right by the plaza. And Susie picked this out actually. We walked around for a bit. She said, we're eating here. And so far, we're just having bread. <laughs> <laughs> That's really good. Okay, we have the coca tea. <laughs> Susie thinks it's cool. Is it hot? It's just hot water and a little bit of tea. Maybe we have to let it sit longer. Plaza de Armas in Cusco. We got some pancakes, eggs. It's like seven in the morning. Um, definitely can feel the pressure. We have a little bit of a headache. It's like subtle. So, but for now, we're gonna eat breakfast and walk around probably and explore a little bit of Cusco before we have our ATV tour at like 12:50. So, lots of walking uphill. We're already doing great. <laughs> we made it to Yete Boreguitos. <laughs> I can't pronounce it, it's horrible. But it's a cute little spot of the seven stairs, and you can take pictures. And it's a little bit of a walk. We're adjusting to the acclimation, but we're doing good. <laughs> She gave us free gloves um, as a present for buying from her. But honestly, she wasn't like so aggressive, which I really liked. A lot of the people, they kind of push you to buy, buy, buy. She was just there talking to us, and Susie got a little vest. Susie, did you get a little vest? Sweater. Oh, sweater. Sweater. <laughs> sweater and some gloves. But we did our little shopping at the market for today. Almonds. Medical Caliph 2 
or after they can bring to this place and they can adapt in all these terraces. <laughs> This is pretty cool. Um, our tour guide said these date back to like pre-Incan times and that each of the levels had different temperatures and that they would use that to do certain crops. So that's crazy. This is the only one that's like really intact. And then there's two other ones um, that they were destroyed. But oh wow, we're 3,000 feet higher. <laughs> In Cusco level and you can feel it I'm breathing heavy but it is absolutely so pretty out here just look at how like the air is clean like everything's just so clean and it's so much fun to do ATV like you're just like out there and experiencing nature Susie's having lots of fun ATVing aren't you Susie yeah. <laughs> almost ran into a, a... I think I'm as bad as that guy though oh yeah what well, the guy that went off the side of the road Right now we're gonna head back and then I think we're taking a bus to the salt mines um, just because they said you can't ATV to the salt mines which I don't mind my thumb kind of hurts from hitting the gas pedal so much <laughs> You're gonna see maybe like a channel, maybe, or maybe you're gonna see white. What is that? Salt. Okay, she's dropping. This oil, remember, oil just for massage with pink salt and also with. This was the chocolate that we tried, so we got some of them. <laughs> because um, the sun reflects off of the, all the salt because it's white so they tend to work at like 2 3 in the morning they said crazy yeah since the sun is gone it's freezing cold um, so recommend coming during the day <laughs> or at least when the sun the sun just literally went down and it's so fucking cold but powering through for all the bags they've collected of salt that's so crazy just like what and I think that's it for today. We're gonna drive back and then go have dinner. Ooh, yay! <laughs> All right, so we're here at Marina Kitchen. We're at, um, we're at a Peruvian kitchen, sorry. And um, we made a reservation like a month in advance because this seems to be the spot everyone likes to go to. Um, so we're starting off with drinks. I got a mango soda. 
It's so cute for mango soda and Suzy got a tropical. Tropical. <laughs> tropical. But they're so cute for what they are. Like Ooh, that was <laughs> good. two hours to the mountain. I guess everyone comes here to eat breakfast. We're really tired, but we're doing it. We're not even that high yet. Food dog, wait, wait. We gotta go higher. Yeah. 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 We're chachadas. <laughs> Almost there. <laughs> She's like, we're in immigration camp. They yell at us to go, bathroom, go eat. <laughs> you got 15 minutes. <laughs> this is really funny. Alright, we're starting our trip. We're supposed to do it faster than everyone else because we're doing Red Valley. We'll see how it goes. Okay, so right now we are in the Andes. Uh, so look at this. That is the first highest mountain. It's uh, 6,300 meters above sea level. And right now I go into the Rainbow Mountain. No? Hola chica, how are you? We're dying. Yeah, That's... this is Gringo Killer. Huh? <laughs> Maybe I want to sacrifice. What's your name? Susie. Susie. Susie, thank you so much for offering. <laughs> I tried flying my drone and I got yelled at in Spanish and I just, I knew what he was saying but I was just like, tell me in English. <laughs> and they give you 20 minutes to take pictures because you have to hike back down. But the line is so long. So we're not even doing Red Mountain anymore, which is over here. This hike up to do Red Mountain. ¿Cuántos? Yay. We did it. Okay. One night out of nowhere. Oh, we're making our descent. Experience, honestly, not that good. I thought this is a hike that we can enjoy, you know, take our time. Especially with the elevation, no wonder people get sick. They rush people to hike up the mountain, hike up the mountain. Okay, we only have 20 minutes for pictures. Like the line was already 30 minutes and we didn't even get to go up under the tippy tippy top. So we ended up taking pictures with the llamas, which there was no line and then took pictures on the side and then we had to go. Like, I don't know. Experience, honestly, it's very like, they just want to make money. They charge you for toilet paper, um, the passport stamp they charge you. 
um, the only nice part was like the llamas. She was like, it's up to you. I took, gave her 20 because she was probably the nicest person, 20 soles, the nicest person to talk to us, but I don't know. It's just a money grab for them. It's new, I get it, it's six years old. It's just, <laughs> like there's no signs anywhere that says you can't fly a drone. This man just yelled at me. Like I said, me and Susie did it. We died, but we did it. We didn't do Red Valley, but I mean, it's fine. It's not the end of the world. And now we're making our hike down. And it's only 11.21 also. We were barely there. Like, <laughs> a full day trip to be on a mountain for 20 minutes and not enjoy it. Kind of seems like a scam, honestly, but whatever. Check back in when we reach down the mountain. <laughs> well, we are alive. Um, we did sleep, I think, a good 11 hours, 12 hours. Um, thank God. We're at Cafe de Lossi right now. And we're just enjoying our little slow morning before we head to Lima. And then we're going to have one day there and head to Paracas and Mocatina. It was fun while it lasted. <laughs> Anyways, thanks for watching. Go watch our other vlogs. And have a wonderful, splendid day. Bye! Three, let's go! Let's go! And right now, I'm going upstairs. Holy shit, it's hard. This is not for the week. Oh my god, that's a really good sausage. What's it? Elevation. <laughs> My hands are like sweating. <laughs> <laughs> they were good. <laughs> okay, so talk to the camera. We made it to Cusco. Breathing. <laughs> Breathing. Acclimating. <laughs> oh, oh sorry. <laughs> You're fine. <laughs> that was so zoomed in. Wonderful. 